What's going on guys? So Tautog slash Blackfish season just opened and 9 times out of 10 what you're using for bait for them are crabs. So to go along with the budget conscious theme of my channel, I'm going to show you how to harvest crabs on your own. Now the two most common species of crab that are used for blackfish bait are Asian crabs and green crabs. Green crabs are an invasive species from Europe that arrived here in the late 1800s. But they have recently been pushed north towards Maine by another invasive species, the Asian crab. Asian crabs arrived in the northeast in the late 1980s and have caused a pretty much complete exodus of green crabs off Long Island. So today I'm going to be harvesting these Asian crabs on the north shore of Long Island. Now this is most easily done at low tide, but I'm going to be doing it today an hour after high tide for the sake of the example. You're going to find them underneath rocks in extremely rocky areas such as this with clay in the soil. You will only find them under the rocks below the high tide line, so the closer you are to low tide, the more real estate you have to work with. This is the ideal bait for blackfish, but also porgies and black sea bass will be drawn to them like candy. You can fish them on a traditional high-low rig, or if you want better results, try fishing them on a bottom sweeper jig. These crabs are indigenous to the Pacific coast of southern Russia all the way down to Hong Kong. What has made them such an effective invasive species in so many parts of the world is their ability to tolerate very different salinities and also very different temperatures. He's out of his shell. Why? <gasps> Ow! That one's a little bigger. Alright, so this harvest was just for demonstration purposes, I'm going to release them here. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe, and ring the bell for notifications on future content. I'll see you guys next time.